Hey folks, welcome back to Software Testing Hacks. In this video, let's see how we can install Java so that we can get started with learning Selenium. Before we begin, if you have not subscribed to the channel, please do subscribe to the channel. So let's get started. So first, let's see whether Java is there in our machine or not. So you can check with Java and then hyphen version. So it says that Java is not recognized. So now, First, we will install Java. So firstly, search for download Java and you will see a, a you know, reference from Oracle. So click on this Oracle and then here under Java downloads, you can see that there are multiple versions available like Java, JDK uh, 23 and then JDK 21. Okay. So the latest one is JDK 23. So we will go ahead and install it. So since I'm using Windows, so I'll go to Windows and then install the exe file. Okay. And then you, if you're using Mac, you can go ahead and then download from Mac. If you're using Linux, you can go ahead and then download from Linux. Okay. So once this file is downloaded, so we will then click on S. So it gets installed now and then we will click on next. So nothing much to set up here. So if you see uh, it is uh, the file path it is showing, it, it will get, uh, you know, the folder will be created under program files. Okay. And then the next and it will install. And then close. So since we installed Java, let's see whether we are able to um, access Java or not. If it is available or not here. Okay. So yes, it is able to identify. So suppose in case if you are not able to, uh, I mean the path is not getting recognized. In that case, you can go to the system properties. Okay, go to your advanced prop, you know, settings and then go to the system properties. So here, click on environment variables. Okay, and under environment variables, add this, edit, and then add the uh, the file path. We will go to the path. We will go to the C drive, program files. And then here you can see Java folder is created. And then J under JDK, there is a bin. So copy this path. Okay. And after you copy it, come to this system property and then add new path. Okay. And then save it. By now, after uh, you save this, you must be able to identify. Even in case if it is not able to identify or if it is throwing any error, that case you can also add the here come to the Java JDK here all the path. So copy this path and then Java add here. Okay. So come here and then add the here. Click on new and then add Java underscore home. Okay. And then add the variable value. This is the path. Okay. So, and then click on OK. And then OK. So, now at least it should work. So, you can again close. Okay. And then you can check in the command prompt. Type Java hyphen version. So, at least now you should be able to see the version. So once you're able to see the Java version, which means that you're success, you have successfully installed Java and then the version is available. Okay. So in coming videos, we will get started with the complete flow. Okay. So thank you for watching. Bye-bye.